So I ended the evening with my stitching and I began the day with my stitching. I'm up early this morning and I have my coffee and I turn on the calming music and I curl up under the quilt and open my picnic basket and just have some time before the day gets crazy, before the professional development Zoom meetings, before the house is awake. And this is just oh, such a treasure to have just a little bit of time. And I don't know why we feel like we have to apologize or why we have to reward ourselves with this special time. I think our soul needs it as much as we need, uh, as much as our body needs food. So let's not apologize. Let's just say, you know what? This is, this is the time that I need to, to sort out all my anxieties, to sort out my day, to just have some time to have some creative energy and um, get things stirring. Just the way the coffee gets, gets you energized. Um, working with your hands gets you energized as well. And I was thinking as I, as I put those hexi flowers together and I begin the little whip stitches, I do an anchor stitch first, just so that it doesn't all fall apart by the end. And then when I get to the end, I do another anchor stitch. I think, is that how we begin the day and how we end the day with an anchor stitch of making sure it doesn't unravel? And I, I work along and I stitch and I stitch and I stitch. And then there's a snag. And I have to work out the knots and get it going smooth again. And that's, that's how this week went. I was supposed to take off um, and go off for the week with my husband as he had a conference. And I was going to take my computer with me and do my uh, professional development there in the hotel room and have some calm and quiet. But there's snags and there's double ear infection with little granddaughter. And, and I think, oh... I'll just, I'll stay home. And then there's the gift that comes with that snag. We don't expect, we don't anticipate, but there was time to spend with the other two grandchildren. It was a treasure. And so let's not get hung up on the snag that we think, oh, I could have been doing, oh, it could have been this. Sometimes there's good that comes from that little bit of a, of a bump in the day, a bump in the road. And so um, that's my thoughts this morning. And I, I appreciate everyone's comments last night. You made me feel very much better about myself. And sometimes we do need a little incentive uh, just, to, just to get the things done that have to be done, the, the things that aren't as pleasant or that, uh, that wear us down. And you think, oh, if I can just get through that, then I have all afternoon and evening to do that thing that I love. So that's, that's what was on my mind, um, and I don't know what's on yours this morning or what your day looks like, but I hope it's, it's wonderful and that you're staying cool and that you're hanging on to these, savoring these last days of summer the way we are. So have a peaceful rest of your day and take care until next time.